head into Tatooine to take care of Kandersis' side quest. Hooray! Hooray! We gotta resolve your dad's issues. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> I think he's still mad about I think he's still when mad about I when I in put Brett's in his hair. <laughs> <laughs> I actually did do that. I actually did do that too when I was a little girl. How dare you? Like, he was taking like, a nap on the couch, and, and apparently, I thought that my dad, should, that look my dad should look beautiful. Oh, no. And so, and my, so dad, my dad, he wakes up, and he goes down to him, and he goes home, and he's like, he's like, Han, people, people are weird today. <laughs> she's like, what do you mean? She's like, everyone kept staring at me. <laughs> Like, she's like, have you looked, like, looked in the mirror? Like, he's like, what do you need? She's like, like, go look. And he's like, Todd! <laughs> that, that, that's hilarious. Hey, can I annoy you, Cars? Yes, fuck, 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 fuck. Do you know anything about this place? Other than, Other than that's nothing sand but and sand and rock. And it gets oh, everywhere. By the way, I just realized that, uh... And nice joke there. And nice joke there. <laughs> <laughs> but, I just, but I just realized that... And I forgot what I was gonna and say. And I forgot Day what I was gonna say. Day I know when that happens. Why? Oh man, Car- Uh, oh, not Car- uh, Thank goodness. Candorous is gonna be so aggro. Aggro... I wonder which one of our characters would be like hangry. Right, they need to eat. Right, they need to eat, or they will not be nice. Greetings, humans. A word, if I may. It concerns the Dark Lord of the Sith. What? What? You made Malik. You made Malik. No, human. I mean the true Lord of the Sith. I'm speaking of Darth Revan. Of you. How do you know this? And thank goodness you didn't show up like five minutes earlier before I got kidnapped, or I would have been very confused. No kidding. No kidding. It's like it's, it's, like, it's, like, going it's, it's like it's going along with it's the story. It's amazing. How do you know? How do you know who I am? Listen to me, and all will be made clear. My name is. I'm not even gonna try. I am a a businessman. I and my partner deal in rare items of extraordinary value and power. You're with the exchange. You're with the exchange. No, no, we're not. We're independent operators. Though often our transactions involve those who represent the exchange. Traditionally, we have always done business with the owner of the Ebon Hawk, David King, most recently. After our author were before him, Forex Hawks are before her, but we were reluctant to approach you. You had no ties to the exchange, which was a problem. Even worse, you were a Jedi, not the sort of person we normally associate with. Sir Sam, look at your two shoes. Sir Sam, look at your two shoes. Uh, 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 good point. point. Uh, get to the I point. I do you know my true identity. And there are reports of the Emin Hawk traveling to many different planets. We want to know what you were up to. At your last port, I placed a small tracking device on your ship. The tracking what? device reported back what? to us that you had been captured by the Scython. Once we had that information, we began digging into our sources within the Sith fleet. The crap. The I totally crap. forgot about this. <laughs> There are millions of soldiers in the Sith fleet. Surely you aren't surprised that some of them would sell information? Even high-ranking officers aren't immune to the lore of easy credits. Your escapades on the Leviathan created quite a stir in the Sith fleet. Of course, Malik tried to suppress the truth about your identity. There were many more than a few summary executions. But even if security footage is destroyed and witnesses silenced, some bits of information always slip through. Spend enough credits to gather the tiny pieces and the puzzle becomes clear. We know what happened on Leviathan. At least we know enough. You are Darth Revan, and you're going to kill Malak for daring to claim dominion over the Sith. Uh. Uh. How does this involve How you? does this involve you? My partner and I deal in very rare and powerful items: weapons, armor, things you could use in your battles against Malak and the Sith. Uh. Uh, you're just going to give these items to me? I don't carry these items with me, of course. They're with my partner, but they're yours if you got the credits to buy them. We do want to make a profit on this, after all. Just go to the Dreshde Cantina on Korriban. There's a Rodian there named Mekadoran. Tell Micah that 
Zag blah 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 sent you to look at the premium items. I'll check it out the next, I'll check time, it out the next time on Corbin. Like I already know the tricks about you. Like I said, just tell him you want to look at the premium items. I guess my work here is done. Goodbye, Revan. And once Malik is being, don't forget who helped you to victory. Excuse, oh my goodness. Excuse oh my goodness. me? Excuse me? <laughs> Excuse me? And I was just like, what? 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 How dare you? How dare you, sir? But you know he's probably right. But you know he's probably right. Oh, <laughs> like oh yeah, really? We're gonna, need, we're, gonna need, we're gonna need all the help we could get. Against Malik? Are you serious? Yep. Yep. Oh yes, because Malik's so hard to beat. He is. He is. Right, I'm gonna see if this ages well or not. <laughs> we're gonna die. We're probably gonna die. I've played enough times, I know. I know a trick or two. I'm joking. <laughs> I know, I'll be fine. Oh. Yes, let me out there so that way Candace can slaughter this dude. I mean, uh, come dude. to a peaceful dude. solution! <laughs> Obvious. Obvious. That's how Mandalorians settle things. Cough. You know, they just hold hands, you know, they just hold hands and Kumbaya. sing Kumbaya. Exactly. Kumbaya, my lord. Because <laughs> that's obviously, how, that's Mandalorians obviously are. how Mandalorians exactly are. Exactly how they are. They're like the most, They're like passive, the most people passive people. I know, ever. you could like poke them with a stick and they'll do nothing. Exactly, they'll just, exactly, they'll just stare at you. That would be kind of scary though. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness, oh my goodness ever do ever a poke a Mandalorian. That would end very badly for you. Hello, dude. I think I think he's you? over here somewhere. If I if my memory is serving me correctly, I think. If I remember. Okay, I do remember. Thank goodness. I'll oh, be yay. like, like oh, we're gonna be wandering this entire desert. <laughs> How come you're not Mandalorian armor? Uh, I guess one. I do not need to hear your excuses, Jedi. I know why you brought me. Enough of this talk, Joggy. Let's do what we came here to do. Uh, uh, I guess one. I guess one. And you shall all die. Says you. Says you. Wow. I know, very anticlimactic, I know. That was sad. That was sad. I think this has affected me in ways that I didn't anticipate. I think I'll need time to sort things out. Thanks for what you did. Whatever your intentions might have been, I just need time. Aww. Aww. Sorry, Dad. I want to see what he says when he said, let's try to calm down or something. I want to see what he yeah, says. That'd be yeah, that'd be interesting. Okay, let's quick save it. Then we can do what one we want. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I'm so glad I actually remembered where this fight took place. <laughs> yeah, that's funny. Yeah, that's funny. Look, we were a little busy being captured, okay? You brought some of your own as well. Ha! Indeed I did. I foresaw that you might need help, so I arranged a distraction. So I came on my own well. I do not need to hear your excuses, Jedi. I know why you brought me. Enough of this talk, Joggy. Let's do what we came here to do. I think you both need to calm down. We both know the stakes here. We both know. This is a matter of honor. I cannot stand by this 
Uh, uh, I guess which one should we say it to? Let's talk to Candace. Yeah. Yeah. He has slandered me and questioned my honor. Among the Mandalore, many have died for lesser insults. I speak truth, and honor is the question here. The deaths of my comrades, your warriors, is a debt in blood that can only be paid by you. You saw prospects for glory. You abandoned the plan and left us to die surrounded by enemies. If I had not attacked when I did, the battle would not have been won so easily. It would still have been won. You sent your own men to die there, Chandris. I cannot forgive you for what you did to us. You will pay. That's not the way it happened. Man, uh... Man, uh... I don't know. Let's talk to him again. The Alfiri were fighting hard. I saw a break in their defenses that left their center exposed. I had to take the chance. If I had not done what I did, many more warriors would have died and the battle would have taken much longer. I stand by my decision. You coward. You glory hunter. You were given orders and were part of a plan. You had a responsibility to us. I... I can regret this. But it was necessary. Uh, uh, I think, I Jackie, think, what he did Jackie, was a what he did was a move. smart like, I'm sorry. move, like, I'm sorry. I have had enough of your prattle, Jedi. This is between Kandorus and I, and we shall settle this now, once and for I know there's a way to do it to make him back down. Now, what was really? it? Really? Yeah, I really? can, but what was it? 